Yep. So uh, if you're like on the fence right now, if you're on the fence, mm -hmm. ah, should I do it? Should I not? You know what? I'm telling you right now, from the bottom of my heart, do it. Exactly. Do it to it. Just you know? jump in the deep end. Yeah. Say. Exactly. Dive in too. D dive, you know, dive in. Right. What's got to lose? I mean, of course, you're gonna pay for it, right? Because you know, I'm mean, like, oh, yeah, I gotta pay no man. You know, I gotta, I, I <laughs> use my resources, right? I use my time and resources. Right. But compared to any other platforms out there, think about the money that you have spent for the past, you know, 10 years or 15 years of your life into English education. How right. much have you spent, right? So if you're like uh, worried about, oh, you know, like uh, I'm spending this money, uh, I'm spending this much money, mm -hmm. you gotta think about what you get out of this investment. Exactly. You know, like uh, it's all about investment. You know, how you're gonna invest your time. So I strongly recommend this YouTube challenge and I guarantee you, as long as you know you do follow our feedback, as long as you do follow our instruction mm -hmm. and you follow every step of the way, then we guarantee you, you will be a different person Absolutely. in four weeks, right? And then you are getting the habit out of it. Yes. Once you get this habit and you're gonna apply even after this challenge is over, then I'm sure that your English will improve in no time. Absolutely. Agree? Absolutely, it's it's a it's a great like like I said as you said it's not something with it's not like you're you'll become a native speaker within four weeks yeah but it sets a great foundation to yeah. build on yeah you gotta think about you know uh, you you need to have a like infinite mindset yes. infinite mindset is not okay it's finite four weeks six weeks mm. or like six months English is concurrent and I don't have to speak English anymore no it's not like that. Mm -hmm. It's like working out, right? Exactly. And okay, you know, four weeks, you know, I can make you six pack. Okay, you go to right. the, you go to the gym, you know, you work out two hours a day, three hours a day, you work out like a crazy. Exactly. For four weeks later, okay, you got a six pack. And after that, okay, I'm done. Okay, now you go, <laughs> uh, you, you know, you order like a chicken, and you like eating chicken like and every single day, and beer and all that. Beer, <laughs> and then in no time, you're gonna see yourself like, oh, what the heck is that? You know, it's exactly. not like you know what, what I got. What I'm doing, my yeah, what yeah. I'm to this nice six pack, this this body that I have. So I'm always telling my students that English is not English is not something that you're gonna conquer. Mm -hmm. English is not something that oh, you know, I'm gonna master. Right. It's a, uh, it's not a destination. It's exactly. not a destination. It's a part of a journey. You gotta do it. It's like you know working out, right? Mm -hmm. So just because you know you get to a point where you feel like, oh, you know, I feel comfortable, doesn't mean you gotta stop. You gotta keep going at it. That's why habit matters. Exactly. Force of habit matters than anything else, right? Like I'm a native speaker, and yeah. there's still a lot of vocabulary in the English language that I, I'm learning all the time. Exactly. Like exactly. I'm still learning English myself, and I'm a native yeah. speaker from Canada. So yeah, yeah, exactly. It's learn. <clears throat> excuse me. The learning never stops, and even just like new idioms are always being developed, new, like new words are always yeah. being developed. Yeah, you know. Yeah. So and also, I want I want to point out the beautiful thing about like YouTube channel is not about only having a like, casual conversation. Right. It's about you learning stuff. You're exactly. building your knowledge, and then you apply it to your life, and right. you're just explaining to somebody else, thinking that they're gonna have a better life because of your explanation, because of your like your knowledge, right? Exactly. Yeah. A lot of people they think that uh, watching movies is uh, one of the best ways. Okay, maybe one of the best ways. Right. But the thing is, if there is nothing that you learn so much from like uh, that movie, mm -hmm. I mean, are you going to talk about that movie all the time? It's not like that. Exactly. But what we pick, you know, those topics that we pick, mm -hmm. it's a uh, relatable. It's something that we can relate right. in our daily lives, right? Absolutely. It's a uh, economics, finance, or social science, or politics. It's all great content that we can relate to. Right. That's why you have something to talk about with exactly. your friends. That's what I like about this. Right, or whatever it is you learn, then you can build on that knowledge. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, mm -hmm. so therefore, so as, as Luke said, you're not just learning English, you're also, you know, you're learning about n social issues. You're, yeah, yeah. You're, you're just learning, period. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know? Yeah. So that's another part that I wanted to really, really uh, emphasize the beautiful thing about like, YouTube challenge. Anyway, so thank you for joining me. I think I talk a lot because you know, I'm so enthusiastic about this challenge. Yep. And uh, compared to any other, like, uh, any other resources that I've used in order to improve my uh, students' English, and uh, this YouTube challenge has been actually by far, by far the best content, by far mm -hmm. the best method that has been really working out I for agree. my students. So I know it's not easy. Nothing is easy. Right. You know, you gotta step out of your comfort zone. You gotta explore some kind of like a moment that, oh my God, I'm so tired. <laughs> oh my God, it's just so challenging. But that's the sign that you are improving. Exactly. You gotta think about that. Exactly. Stepping out of comfort zone, right? So I'm gonna make you guys work hard. I'm gonna make you guys speak more, okay? Then you will see the result and we 
will do our best to guide you into the right direction. And Norman and I and other coaches out there, right. they're going to help you along the way. Absolutely. All right, trust us, apply, and see you on YouTube Challenge. Yep. See you guys later. Looking forward to working with you guys. All right, take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right, man. Good.